Oh shit. Here we go. Every time I come here, I play the role of their ideal. Like some shared fantasy. Kokichi's fantasy. I can only imagine how insane this will get. Oh, man. <clears throat> it's been a while since I landed into trouble like this. Huh? Trouble? <laughs> Trapping me in a place like this? That's very like you, Mr. Detective. So I'm still a detective in his fantasy. Am I supposed to be chasing him? But... But I won't tell you where I hid the stolen gem. Torture won't work either, you know. Wait! I I'm not going to torture you. What exactly do you think a detective does? Uh... You're planning on tying and roughing up my body, aren't you? That's why there's a bed, huh? Hey! N no, no, you've got it all wrong. Why? Eh? But isn't this what happens to a phantom thief when they're caught? Huh? A phantom thief? But you know, if if you're into some crazy kinks, even I won't be able to keep up. That's not true. I said you've got it wrong. No, wait a minute. We shouldn't be arguing. I'm in Kokichi's fantasy. I should calm down and play along. All right. So Kokichi is a phantom thief, is he? Hey. I'm not gonna do anything to you. From here on, from here out, you're the cops' problem. If you're trying to rile me up to give yourself a chance to escape, no dice, Kokichi. Did I get caught? Oh, figured it out already. Jeez, I was willing to let you do whatever you want to me, since I love you, Shuichi. Wow! But wow, you even researched my name! My identity is bare and naked for your eyes only! But... Kokichi, did you just call me Shuichi? Yeah. Yeah, well, looking up your name was a piece of cake. Ah, so I'm not a different person here. I'm me, and Kokichi is Kokichi. I know I'm supposed to be his ideal, but even when he tells me he loves me, I can't help but think he means the opposite. <laughs> if you're not gonna do anything, then maybe I will. Before my mind even had a chance to process it, Kokichi's grin was upon me. Ugh. Hey! I stepped back reflexively. I had no idea what he was capable of. Hey. No need to be scared. What did you think I was going to do to you? Because... Uh, I'm simply being cautious. We aren't exactly friends, Kokichi. Are we? This whole situation is too strange for me to get my bearings. Having this kind of conversation only makes it harder to know why I'm here. Uh... Jeez, don't be so cold to me. You've been chasing after me for so long. The ceiling part doesn't excite me as much as being pursued by you, you know. Uh... Don't you feel the same, Shuichi? You weren't bored playing with me, were you? That's... Uh, well, I wouldn't say... <laughs> well, I don't care what you think anyway. Hmm. Because you just do as you please, don't you, Kokichi? Ah. Are you mad because I toyed with you? Don't worry, I'm always thinking about you. You're always trying to give... <laughs> You're always trying your best to catch me. I really have to give it my all to win. But... You seem to be rather enjoying this, for a cornered criminal. Yeah. Cause the game's not over yet. Shuichi! Hey Shuichi, what would you do if I told you that I wanted you to catch me? Huh? It's true! There's a transmitter on my body, so my friends probably have this place surrounded already. <laughs> Looks like you'll be the one getting all tied and roughed up, Shuichi. Huh? Th that's not... possible, right? It couldn't be. I was taken off guard by Kokichi's words, but then I remembered our roles. Wait! Kokichi, your lies don't work on me. Aww, you're, you're not, not... shaken up at all. I thought you would be more excited. That's too bad. I really wanted your eyes to be on me. I thought you didn't care about how I felt. That was a lie. You know, since I'm a liar. But when I said I wanted you to catch me, that was definitely not a lie. What do you mean? It means you can do whatever you want to me. And that's the truth. Come, play with me. Let's do a lot more together. <laughs> Kokichi moved toward me. For every step he took, I took one back, but my feet hit the bed. Kokichi! But Kokichi wasn't listening at all. He pushed me hard onto the bed. Kokichi, wait, wait! Just kidding. Did I get ya? What? 
Kokichi didn't answer as he sprinted toward the exit. Kokichi, stop right there. I tried to give chase, but my knees were weak as I tumbled off the bed. We are mortal enemies in this fantasy, but still, Kokichi couldn't be leaving. I caught myself wishing he would stay before I smothered the thought. <laughs> that was pretty fun. See ya, Shuichi. I'll think of a more exciting game for next time. So make sure you excite me too. Kokichi turned his back to me with a flourish, and then placed his hand on the door. Well, that was disappointing. <laughs> Still great, nonetheless. <laughs>